I'm here at the Rhine Falls in Switzerland. It's located maybe 30, 45 minutes north of Zurich. It's the river Rhine behind me. And uh, you see it drops a little bit. I think the biggest waterfall, so to speak, in, in all of Europe. It's not the highest one, but uh, it certainly is uh, very impressive. Where I'm standing now, uh, it's free, okay? You don't have to pay to enter. If you want to go on these uh, boats to go really close, or you can go on up to that rock. There, free, obviously, you have to pay. Now, which side of the Rhine River should you go to? Now I'm here on the northerly side of the Rhine River, okay? But if you look on a map, it's the left side, okay? Here you got the whole restaurant bit, a little bit more touristy. Uh, on the other side, you have got a platform, okay? Where you can walk onto and just be over the water flowing underneath. It's a very, very cool experience. So if you have time, visit the two sides of the river. It's usually not that uh, very busy, uh, so definitely something worth doing while you're in the area. Parking when you come here is also not very expensive. It starts from five francs for one hour, but then small increments continue. And also don't forget, if you come by car, you can also come by train to Schaffhausen or by tour. From so you can obviously take the highway, but I would recommend you just go a little bit on the, on the side roads. And in this video up here, I will explain to you which restaurants or what the restaurant names are that you should look out for to have an authentic Swiss lunch, for example. It's the canton of Zurich, okay? You know the city of Zurich, but you have to see the canton of Zurich as well. It's something very cool to see. Very, probably not what you will be thinking of, uh, what it will look like. Take care and see you soon around. Bis bald und tschüss.